today. I'm so, so excited. I'm joined by my mom, the amazing, wonderful, talented <laughs> Carrie Fisher. Scent, scent smeller extraordinaire. Scent extraordinaire, absolutely. So I wanted to show her all of my favorite <clears throat> summary scents and see what she thinks about them and rate them, put them in order. So I wrote down my rating over here in a secret spot. Top secret. Top secret. And uh, yeah, let's just get going. Just pick whatever okay. you want. And uh, I thought you were going to like introduce them to me. Or... I'll introduce them to you. Okay. Okay. So let's start with Calypso Clementine. The scent notes are Juicy Clementine, the Rolly Nectar, and Coastal Woods. You can spray it into the cap if you want to. It's, I could definitely smell the, the Clementine, but it also, I feel like it could be unisex, you know? Yeah. And it's not gonna be number one. I do know that. Okay, I got it. Okay. This one I already know you like. Brightest blue. Oh. I don't have the notes on this one because it's a little one, but you know that one. I almost went somewhere there on my counter. Uh, is the goat. Yeah, this is. I love that one. This is number one for now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> then the other little one from this summer that just came out is dressed in white. Oh, I did remember this one too. We smelled this one, you. Very clean. And as you would say, grown up sexy. You know, if there's a gardenia note in there that I don't usually like, I don't usually like I gardenia. Like gardenia. Yeah, that's I don't one like my it. favorite. Really? But I like it in this. That's probably what you say. It's when I say my mom. It's probably those ones. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I I like it, but it has a little bit of too much powdery for me. Okay. Then we have endless sea. The notes are fresh bergamot, saltwater lily, and ocean driftwood. Mm. You have to do the ocean. I'm already gonna vote for it. That's definitely a good like for a day outside. Oh, know? I love that one. When yeah. I first saw this one, I was like, I'm not gonna like it. It's no, I thought it would be super like, manly too. Yeah, like it's manly not, water, it's, and it, it's really good. But it could be unisex also. Yeah, that, but, when that one came out, they said it was unisex. Hmm. This I could totally see like literally wearing out for like a walk or like a picnic or something. Like it's yeah. fresh. Okay. Definitely, I like these two. Okay. And then we'll do gingham fresh. It's juicy pear, sparkling clementine, and fresh daisies. Mm, well, this could be good. Not as good as it sounds. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> well. Yeah, I think it's super fresh. When you said daisy, I'm like, what does a daisy even smell like? Because it reminds me of it <laughs> smells like dirt or something. I don't yeah. have a ton of smell, so I was a little bit sus on that one. This is my least favorite so far. Ooh. I'm surprised, but yeah. Okay. Let's hit Groovy Watermelon. This one's so good. Mm, that sounds good. It sounds fun. Like, yes. playful. Juicy Pink Watermelon, Sugar, Strawberry Blossoms, and Lime Zest. <sighs> this one has come out, like, and it's been in different packagings and different names. Oh, okay. Stuff, so. What were some other names? The only thing I would know. Um, what was it called before? Something Pop? Watermelon sugar pop. I mm. can't remember. I do like that. I think it's something like our it's like my candy. grandkids, your nieces could wear and and not be smelling too grown up, you know what I mean? Or too <sighs> excess. Super um it sweet. Like, like smells like sour patch watermelons. Yes, it does. So good. Yeah, I like that. I think I'm kind of right here with these two. The two fruity ones is kind of funny. The clementine and the watermelon. Okay, let's hit <sighs> fresh cut lilacs. This one's bust and bust. That's my bathroom soap right now. <laughs> <laughs> lilac bouquets, dewy greens, and soft spring air. Yeah, I know you like this one too. This is all. This is always a go for me. But I don't. I haven't smelled the spray. Oh. Smell. I love sitting here. I have to hurry up and smell this one with because this is going to be like a, a top two. The thing is, I like the smell of this one better, but I'd rather my body smell like this when I go out. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. So yeah. I, I think this is a beautiful smell, but do I want to smell like it all the time? No, this is just a little more neutral, but still floral, I think, yeah. for, to wear as a scent. Yeah. So as far as smells go, I like this one better, but I'd rather wear this one, if that makes sense. Okay, okay. Because We're it's down to the a little bottom much, too. like, I don't want to say old ladyish, I, I know I'm old ladyish, but. I love it. Yeah, no, I, I'd like I to, mean, but I like it more as like a hand soap or a lotion more than like a wear out 
Yeah. Your whole body smell like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I get you. Let's do Sweetheart Cherry. Came out this Valentine's Day. How could Day. that be bad? It's wild cherry, crushed pistachio, and whipped vanilla. I just don't like the ones with the nutty notes, but we'll see. It's Remember, I always love strawberry pound cake, and it has some nuts. I don't. I didn't like it last year. It had some yeah. weird nut background. I'm giving it all away. That's pretty good. It's, it smells a lot like the black cherry merlot. It can you, you kind of smell the pistachio, can't you? It's obviously heavy cherry. Heavy cherry, but yeah, but it has yeah, almost it's, like pistachio ice cream. It's more yeah. of a pistachio. It's a sweet pistachio. Yeah. Yeah, I totally get that. So I really that. like that. I'm I'm really putting this up in the top four for now. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and then last but not least, we have ice lemon pound cake. Do you know this one? Um, I have a candle of that. Okay. It's sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake. And then John John's lemon creme brulee that we love. So. Oh my god, my brother makes the best creme brulee in the world. Totally like death metal singer, hair down to his waist, and makes lemon brulee like the best. It's so good. Oh, <laughs> that's, I don't like one at all. That's like hazelnutty or something. Is there nuts in there? No, it smells like cake. I'm gonna force you to tell me. No, that makes me cough. That one okay. that reminds me, you know how you know how I am with hazelnut like scents and flavors? It makes me cough. That's how that that has something in it. A lot of people have coughing. say some Beth marks that makes them cough. That's there's something one. nutty in this. What is the things? It smells like lemon and cake. Something in the pound cake has yeah, that's, there's something nutty in there. I'm saying that's just, that's, that's my 100% least favorite. And not okay. that it's horrible, it just makes me feel like coughing. So that's it. So what's uh, your order going to be? Oh, gosh. I'll put it more down here. We can face it to them. Oh, they all have different good purposes. You have to decide. It's okay. life or death. Okay, can I make these two have way. a tie? I have to lower the camera so they can. These see. two have a tie. Okay. And the rest these are the are same? These are a tie, yeah. Oh, okay. wait. I think I like. Yeah, that's. Yeah, that's probably. These two, I'm, I'm you, not huge on these two. Do you need to give another sniff of anything? No. I, these, like, this is definitely first. These two are very close. These two are tied, which is funny because they're in totally different categories. You got the fruity and then you got the. Like that clean outside Aquatic. scent. And then they're both fruity, which is not something I usually pick for myself. But I like both these. They still smell really clean. More clean, more crisp, more fun. I think more sugary. Mm -hmm. And this one I do like. Um, I think it's a little strong. Like if you use more than a couple squirts, it might be too much. Yeah. But it still it's smells powerful. really good. These ones I wouldn't put on my body to go outside. Okay. Got it. First is Brightest Blooms. Fresh Cut Lilacs. Tide. Endless Sea and Sweetheart Cherry, Clipso Clementine, Groovy Watermelon, Dressed in White. Mm, do you know what this is? Was that looking at it? Gingham Fresh. Gingham, Fresh yeah. yeah. And Ice Lemon Pound Cake. So, okay, let's compare. Ice Lemon Pound Cake Hazelnut is what I, my, my thought is. Let's compare okay. with what my favorites are. Okay. Will you move them to yep. the front? Mm -hmm. Okay, my first is Groovy Watermelon. <laughs> my second is Sweetheart Cherry. Oh, I'm making a huge mess. My next is ice lemon pound cake. What? Do you like hazelnut? No. Okay. It's not hazelnut to me. It 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 has the same. Oh, well, people have different sniffers. Yep. Different sniffers. My next is brightest bloom. Oh, Woo! Dang. Then fresh cut lilacs. I already know how this is gonna go. Dressed in white. This is. I'm not sure what this one. And let's see. <laughs> Calypso clementine. Already knew. See, and look. Gorgeous. Or, Theme fresh. Yeah. Okay. So pretty what do you different, think? actually. Yeah. It is different. Yeah. I'm struggling. But look at this. It's a beautiful struggle. I'm adding that out. <laughs> <laughs> I can't now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Cool. So, yeah. Definitely pretty different. And then. Oh, you have this honorable mention you wanted to do. I do have a couple. I just want to hear your opinion on this. Do you want me to tell me a name for, or just smell it? Yeah, why don't you smell it? Oh, it's called If You Musk. Oh, I'm already, 
I already have a bad <laughs> bad sign, but <laughs> so did I. But, but you know, I thought you were around the other day. I thought I said, "Oh my gosh, you smell good." And you said, "Mask." And I was like, "Really?" I think it was that one. Like about a week ago, maybe. It's actually nice. I like that. I like it too. So this is polarizing, this is crisp and floral. I like this. I like it too. It's iris, pink pepper, and airy musk. I would put that up in my top four. To be that's honest, that's good, right? I haven't, yeah. I haven't worn it enough, so that's why I haven't. Put I like it in it. my summer favorites, but this scent is no, polarizing. This is good, and it's light enough. It's almost like not a commitment. Like you have a good smell, but it's not yeah. like like Bryce Blooms. You know your floral. This is just yes. kind of a, something smells good. I just yeah, I wanted you to sniff it because like it. some people hate it. I love it, but I like it too. I like it. It's supposed to be like a. It's like a dupe for a Valentino scent, I guess. Really, I I like that. I I would wear that out. Okay, and yeah. last one. This isn't a BBW one. This is uh, Fineries, not another cherry. I won't say anything about it because I just need to smell it first. Oh, it's a big spray. <laughs> I like them big. I think it's more manly than girly. Mm, okay. I don't think it's horrible, but like if I, if a, if a dude came up to me and I came home and he smelled like that. I'd be like, he smells good and clean and, you know, he mm -hmm. put some effort out. Not that I really like my man cologne up. But it's clean. I think a girl, I, I feel it's more masculine though. But yeah, it's good. I love this one. For you? For me. Interesting. It's a woman's scent. Something you want to tell me? Well, it's yours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like man scent sometimes. <laughs> Crazy. Uh. I like him too, just not on me. I mean, you know. I love this one. I was curious to what see what it? you thought about it. Not another cherry. Oh. This is supposed to be a dupe for I think it's a Tom clean. Ford perfume. I, I think it's it's clean, but I definitely would picture it more on a man. Yeah, definitely. Do you have any um, favorite scents you want to mention? Or, Well, you know, as you grew up, my favorite was always Jessica McClintock. That was my signature yes. scent for 20 years. Now I've really been into the uh, Gucci Bloom Noir. That's been oh. my scent for the last like year nice. or so. That I really, really love that. It's also floral, so it kind of just goes in that more floral but more like evening floral <gasps> Ow! I feel like. you can't just stab me you want you to pet him. so yeah um gucci bloom noir kitty cam moses <gasps> okay okay i think that's it yeah you feel good about it i don't think there's any bb dubs that i that i really love because i'm like I think I'm, on, I'm stuck on brightest blooms right now as far as like lotion yeah. goes. Your favorite used to be strawberry pound cake. Strawberry pound cake. You mm -hmm. know what we should do mm -hmm. is go through all your scents. We could. Because I went up to her bathroom the other day and she has like 16 lotions that have this much at the bottom. Hey, options, right? Like when you're going to bed, you want something strong on, but yeah. you know, and you, I can't throw them away. I mean, no, but I have granddaughters. I, I give them to them a lot. They come and pick through them. That's why I say them too. Cause they're like, Oh my God, I really want this one. I'm like, yeah. cool. Yeah. And there's a couple that I don't love up there too. Like those strawberry pound cakes I'm giving away. I, I, it makes me cough when I wear it now. I don't know what, something changed, but you know, the love that they came out with it last Christmas and this Christmas, that smells more like strawberry pound cake than the strawberry pound cake is now. So I've been using that in this place. It's just called love, mm -hmm. like the champagne and something. Or something. Yeah, it is like a strawberry champagne almost. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Okay, well, let's wrap it up. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll catch you in my next one. Bye.